Oi everybody, this is Captain Jack British Sparrow. Offering you more Let's Play Legend of Zelda Wind Waker. Actually, no, it's Franklin Thorpe Gamer. Um, alright, well, let's let's get this show on the road now that we've finished the Forest Haven. The leaf is ac absolutely useless on the boat. And, um, oh, my bad. Where must we go? Damn it. No, that's not my map. That's my map. <laughs> wow, all the way over there. That is... Wow, that's quite the distance. Alrighty then. Um, In that case... Let's see, is this the right way then? Yeah, yeah, that's the right way. If I just keep traveling at this speed and this uh, direction, then I should be going to the right place. Well, I'm, not, I'm gonna cut out some of this trip, but some of the trip I want to explain something that I'm doing. Um not really explaining something that I'm doing as much as it's just like a new way of recording videos and by a new way I mean an old way that I used to do when I started recording but um and it's not like you guys care cuz the only thing that really matters to you guys is that you get videos but you're gonna start noticing that I say see you guys later with more Wind Waker at the end of like the every single video or almost every video because um, I'm reverting back to what I used to do. When I first began recording Let's Play videos with my Dazzle, I didn't really have much time due to school, because I think that I started my first console Let's Play, Paper Mario, in, uh, in April of last year. And so I had school going on, and what I was doing was I was recording one video a day of, well, actually no, I was recording two videos, because two 10-minute videos, but now that they've extended the time limit to infinity and beyond, um, I can, I'm gonna go back to the same old system, and I'm just gonna record 15 to 20 minute videos every single day, um, of both games that I'm doing, and that way I can, uh, uh, that way I only have to spend like 50 minutes recording or so, 40, uh, like 30 to 40 minutes recording, and, uh, and that saves me a lot of time, because lately I've switched over to a plan of waiting until, uh, I have a lot of free time and record for like two to three hours so that way I have a lot of videos to produce but um I think that I'm just gonna revert back to the old way of being able to like have enough time for schoolwork and all that good jazz but recording single videos um if that makes any sense I think I explained it in the most confusing way possible but maybe that's just me also um before I start cutting stuff out February 15th, I will have been on YouTube for, well, I would have, I will have been making Let's Play videos on this channel. I'm not really making Let's Play videos. Okay, basically, my channel started last year on February 15th, and February 15th is somewhat soon. So, cough, cough, one year anniversary special, cough, cough. Um, I'll get more details on that to you guys, like, when the time is closer to February 15th, but, um, but yeah, that's just about all I have to say until I, uh, well, before I get to the location, which is right there, so I might as well not even cut it out, because we're intent, no, not intensely close, incredibly close, like, it's literally two panels away. So, I'm just gonna go on continuing by saying, so yes, this means that you will get videos every day now, hopefully. I mean, there may be a time, like, a day here and there where I won't be able to record. It's just, I thought about it. I didn't make any videos this weekend due to straight-up laziness. And, uh, oh, by the way, the island that's really far over there, the, um, that's silhouetted over there, that's the one we're going to. But, um, yeah, sorry that this is a pretty boring segment. Uh, it, you can plan for it to be a boring segment because it's basically just informal stuff. Um, but yeah, so you could start expecting videos just about every day. And I was thinking, I didn't make any videos this weekend, this past weekend, and I sure as hell know that I'm not going to be making videos this next weekend, so I figured, you know, I might as well um, record every day from now on, one video of each game a day. By the way, if you're wondering why I won't be making videos this weekend because people are curious like that um well saturday i have a date and friday i uh f 
Friday I have, okay guys, go ahead and laugh at me and say, ho ho, you're a nerd, but then I'm going to say, of course I'm a nerd, I'm recording video games for with commentary over them, but um, I, I'm kind of into anime and stuff, and I actually, this wasn't my choice, but I'm going to an anime convention, and I'm pretty sure that you, most of you are well aware of the fact that I live in Ohio, and there's a convention called OhioCon coming up, and it's in Columbus, and it's, it's just an anime convention. And like I said, I really didn't have a choice in the matter. I said I didn't want to go, but um, my cousin was like, yeah, no, you need somebody to watch your little cousin, so he, so we have money, don't worry, you're going to be able to go. And I was like, what if I don't want to go? And it's like, too bad, you need to watch your little cousin. And I was like, oh, okay. So basically I'm quote-unquote babysitting at the anime convention, and uh, I'm forced to go against my will, which is all right, because anime is kind of cool, I guess. I mean, I do like it. It's enjoyable. I mean, I'm not, like, obsessed with it, but... Yeah, you guys can read the text on here. Like I said, this is mostly informal stuff. Um... I'm not gonna do this for the Sonic Adventure 2 part that we're watching. Okay, well, you know what? I might as well quit talking about that, because that's incredibly off-topic for, like, the first seven minutes of the video. So, what I'm gonna do is, um... Now I'm gonna talk about this. So, basically, he comes here and says... Oh, well, you see, this island was destroyed. You're probably looking for Jabba and the big fat fish. Well, yeah, this island was destroyed, blah, blah, blah. And, um, I mean, it's kind of obvious it was destroyed. And so now he's going to tell us that Jabon wasn't defeat destroyed in the mess um, of Ganondorf. Like, because Ganondorf came by and destroyed this area. But Jabon escaped and got to, um... Outback Steakhouse, no, I'm sorry, um, well, I'm gonna have to wait to see my map to see the name, because, of course, I, I can't remember it for the life of me. I almost want to call it Outtake Island, but I know that that's not what it is. This should be an outtake of a Let's Play, because, I mean, this is a really, really boring part. But, um, or, yeah, Valu must have been right. Blah, blah, blah. This island is cursed. I would counsel against staying here longer than you have to, but that is your decision. I have told you, you know, I have told you of Jabon, so my task is complete. As he flies off into the distance. Now, I'm not going to stay here any longer than I should, because I, I think that there's some items that I'd prefer to get first before I do anything here. Which, I don't even know if there's anything important here, but there's plenty of places for me to go, but n not without certain items. So, oh, that's right. We need to go to Windfall, um, because Jabon, like I said, is hiding at our, our island, Outset Island, that's what it is, Outset Island, but the pirates weren't even able to penetrate the, um, the wall that's blocking the area that J Jabon's hiding in. So, we need to go all the way back to Windfall, which is... That's Dragon Roost. That's Windfall. Okay, basically, let's see. Going diagonally, that's two panels away, and then that would make this m more than two panels away. So, this is the point in which I'm going to cut out stuff, because I can. Mm, just got to make sure I'm lined up in the right direction... And with that being said, uh, no, stop. Oh, well, I do have to equip the Wind Waker. And do, do, do. Yeah, sorry if I sound incredibly bored. I wasn't really enthusiastic about recording today. Um, I intended for this to be a really informal and boring part. So I decided, you know, if, if more than half of it's going to be informal and boring... Then all of it's gonna be informal and boring. Wah ha 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 ha. Anyways, um, yeah, I'll see you guys at Windfall. Oh, okay, cutscene of some sort. Wait, uh, what? Wait, is where are? Oh, what? We're mad. I'm confused. The screen turned black, and then it just randomly put me here in the same exact area that I was, so it's like the screen turned black for no reason. 
as if it were about to show a cutscene or something. And then it was like, no, I'm just kidding. April Fools, no cutscene. No, but they, yeah, there's windfall. And with that being said, we're finally here. It's just as Postman told us, the pirate ship has stopped here to avoid drawing the attention of the townsfolk. I know not what they are res researching, but if they are hoping to get their hands on Jab and the Sacred Gem, I doubt they would tell you anything directly if you were to ask them. My son, I think you should try to find out what the pirates are up to, without them finding out about you. Alright, I'll do that, King of Red Lions, sir, yes sir. Um, this is actually really easy, basically what, first time through, it's supposed to make you think, oh, where are the pirates? Where'd my mouth go? No, um, where are the pirates? And, okay, let's see if I can do this, just let's make one attempt at it, and if I don't succeed, then I don't succeed. I just want to try this and see if I can save myself some time by wasting your guys's. Sweet! And I just wasted that opportunity. Whatever, let's just do it again, because now I think I'm an expert at it. Just walk up the tree. Yeah, and then just climb onto the wall. The, the Just the camera got confusing last time. Yeah, and it, it makes you avoid having to come around and do that. Now, of course, there's no magical way to get onto the roof faster. But, um... Yeah, that's what we have to do is come in here. And, oh! Funky music. Look, don't be mad at us. It's not our fault that we absolutely gotta have bombs to get the treasure we're after. How about you just think of it as payback for the nasty little monopoly you've been running here? Yeah. Yeah. So I bet you're thinking it was foolhardy to ask pirates to pay such outrageous price, huh? Yep, I bet you are. You know, Gonzo, I still can't get over that bit of fast talking you pulled the uh, that information out of the postman. Huh? Oh, oh yeah, that was smooth. Criminal. Okay, now tell you the minute I set my eyes on that, <laughs> the minute I set my eyes on that, my son, I just knew he was hiding something back at outset. Yeah. So when I saw the postman, I just pretended like I was all worried about that kid and stuff. And presto, he spills the beans. Good work, Gonzo, really. Just top notch. It's funny, though. I'm thinking this is maybe the first time you've shown such wit. Such cunning. You know, with your cunning and Miss Tetra smarts, if you two got married and had a kid, that kid would be the greatest pirate to ever sail the seas. Yup, the greatest. You idiot. Keep your mouth shut, yeah? Don't be so stupid. Miss Tetra, are you listening to this nitwit? Can't you dock him some pay or something? Please don't tell me he's, he's like insinuating that grown man getting married with the kid Tetra. That's, that's just weird. Keep your childish jokes to yourself and get those bombs back to the ship. The second you're done loading them up, we're setting sail for Outset Island. Uh. <laughs> I like his reaction. What? Miss, you, we have to leave immediately? But it's been so long since we were on shore. We need to fill our be bellies with some good eating, yeah? How about we grub, grub tonight and shove off tomorrow morning instead? I mean, uh, I'm fine either way, of course. Whatever you say is fine, miss, is what I meant to say. It's just that the boys were so excited to come to town, yeah? And I can't help but think that it'd be awful hard on them to leave so soon without a proper layover. So, what say we sail tomorrow, yeah? What do you say, miss? That treasure isn't going anywhere. You're with me, right, boys? Who's for a night of fun? You're all fools, do you know that? You saw that demolished island? You saw the senseless destruction? We have to hurry to outset, or the same thing could happen here. I mean, there. My bad. Huh? 
Not to be disrespectful, but the sound of things, you're worried more about that island than the treasure, miss. Don't be ridiculous. I want, you know, the treasure. Dun. Alright, fine. Have it your way. We can leave town tomorrow, you big babies. But we're setting sail at first light, so no sleeping in. Understood? Please. Okay, I'm pretty sure they didn't say aye aye. I'm pretty sure I had heard or some discombobulated noise. Say there, brother. What was today's password again? Mako, are you serious? You forgot it already? Ha, huh, plot device. Well, not really plot device, just, oh, barnacle. Just an excuse to give us the password, though. Okay, blah, today's password is barnacle, yeah. Barnacle, eh? I, I don't, I honestly don't see why they need a password to get around their own ship. Um, I think that, I don't, I think that I'm gonna go ahead and end the segment here. And be like, yeah, alright, suspense, you know, getting the bombs tomorrow. Um, anyways, see you guys later with more Wind Waker, yada yada yada.